What is happening, y'all? Welcome on back. So, took a little break. We are ready to continue. Um, I guess I'll just pepper you a bit. Oh my goodness. You do not like fire, do you? Two of you down here. Oh, three of you. All right, listen. One, yeah, no problem. Two, maybe. Three of you things? Ocean's might. I'm calling it radiant strength. Yep. Attack power, holy. Oh, and it had a uh, it had smite on it. Oh, that's cool. I guess we could take a look at it. It's all right. I mean, I'll be honest. I'm I'm pretty happy with my sword of skin and tooth. This way. Try to figure out how I feel like this should be like kick downable, you know. Alright, um stuff that way. What was over here? Here I killed a thing and there's an umbral bridge. About this way. Is this where I think this is where I came from? Resistant to that. That was bullshit. It's two big dudes duking it out. Brawn ring. That sounds like something I might want. Okay, uh, that's where I saw that other one. This looks... I don't know, this looks like death. I ain't dropping down in that pit. That doesn't sound good. Um, where else do I go? Let me pop on the use. I can put the thing there. It's killing that guy. Yeah. <laughs> 
Oh, you bitch. This is like the start, isn't it? I think it is. Hammer of Holy Agony. Jesus, that push distance. A oh, karma. That was down in the swamp, because we already purged that. I think we just go that way, but kind of want to... Yeet! Yeah, I remember going through all that. Okay. So let me go back in here real fast. I think I cleared out this whole area, but I'm like... I don't know. I feel like it was too short. I killed you. I get back up. I really don't like the way the light hits this wall. Makes me think it's like an illusion. Oh no, yeah, I came in. So I dropped. After I dropped, I climbed up that and was like, no way, I'm not doing that. And then I ran. I went through here. I killed that lady. And then I came this way. Which brought me up top and gave me a shortcut around that bullshit. Which just brought me over to here. And I remember looking at that, not seeing any way to interact with it. You can drop down there and kill him. Kill this guy, cross the path, kill those two. Yeah, okay. I thought I missed something, but no, we're, uh... We're looking good. My thing is, I really don't want to use up my, uh, my thing that I made back in Iceland, so. We need to keep cruising along. Our charts always good. Keep cruising. No flower bits. Probably be able to kick down a ladder soon.
pretty resilient fairy. place to go down. Should be able to st actually sprint through this pretty freaking quick. No, hang on. Go there. I go there. So I already killed you, so I can. Back in business. But now with most of our heals. And loss prevention. Every good adventurer should have a loss prevention program. came here, and then I decided to go this way. He was like, I don't want to fight you, I'm just going to turn around. And I was like, nah, you're dead.
That's progression. Bloody glory. Radiance, physical, holy, with 300 bleed. Damn. Now that, that's a faith weapon right there. God, tons of bleed on it. Holy caked in, 20 strength, 30 agility, 32 radiance. It doesn't even have agility scaling. God. I have a feeling that's like probably an absolutely insane weapon. I mean, for it to have those kind of stat requirements. You'd probably use the thing where it's like a significantly decreased strength, but increased agility scaling. And then offset it because it's what? Let me see bloody glory. You need to what? 20 strength? Yeah. Because you're, you're doing an Agility Radiance build there. I want to use one of these. It is really unfortunate that you just happen to get caught like that. Potential, uh, it's not the second sacred resonance hammer I've gotten. There's two of those bad boys. It's down here. That's where I came in. You know, I know people are gonna tear it apart, but like little bits of jank like that on mini bosses I kind of enjoy it I'm just like yes yes trash you stand no chance against me but I mean hey it's on brand it's funny because we were doing uh what was it I was playing something and someone's like oh I can't believe you're doing this you used to love the challenge and I'm like bro Literally every, every single Souls-like I have ever played. My entire shtick has been how absurdly powerful can I become? What is the maximum amount of Unga Bunga my character can reach? Like, what's the most absolutely busted way that I can kill a boss? Always. For all of eternity of me playing Souls games. Never on this channel have I been like... Boy, boy jolly, I sure hope there's a... ripe but fair challenge for me to overcome with my skillful tenacity. No, well, no, no. You're getting off. Go away. Ow. Oh, I don't have any. Oops. Oh, you're dead from here. Right, so this also looks... progression-y.
There it is. That ladder takes me right back to the bell. I was wondering when I'd find that damn thing. Just sitting on two heels. We could rest. Ain't gonna hurt to rest up. Plus, it's not like I'm re fighting through a ton of stuff. Damn. Hold up. 755. 770. So if I count my two extra points, that should be at a nice round 800 with my shield points. I am. Don't do it. Don't do it. You did it. You had to do it. I tried to give you a fair chance, you know? in here. Ooh, buttload of upgrade mats. I like that. How many is that? How many is that? Uh, where are they at? Oh, I just just found upgrade material. Six. So if I were to... Come here. Come on, buddy. Don't you want to... A little bit of luck, he'll just run straight at me. I don't know how it takes care of it either way. Let's see what's up top here. Because that other area, that looked like it pathed out to a, uh, like, proper new zone connection type of thing. Yeah, I ain't playing that bullshit. seconds away from dying and instead he just had to get one more big pop on me. Very unfortunate. I wonder what the other path leads to. Shoot my ass.
No! Shit! Done bone myself. See, now I'm really torn, because there's... There's a couple different potential areas. I mean, I still... I don't want to place the things. I already placed one over in Winterland. I want to go back there at some point. Let me... Let's go... Let's go this way. And since I got the shortcut, it's easier to explore that path that goes up. So let's go back and see what that path that went outside is. How are you reloading so fast? My crossbow doesn't work like that. Let's see. Hello. Aha! Wonderful. It's totally worth coming back. branded a failure, but see how Judge Cleric has guided me to this sacred path after all. So many brave, fallen, hallowed sentinels. So much sacrifice, yet we can take comfort in the knowledge. Life itself is a long and winding path, and sometimes you carry much, sometimes nothing at all. But the most important things, and they... You have some new loot. I need two of these. Oh boy, new rings. Start Crusaders regenerating health after using the Sanguinarix. Health regen over time. What was the one I got? It was like brawn. Three to strength. It's nice. So, looking at warps, I want to get a, a basis for if the game considers this after the fiefdom or not. It does. Wow. Okay. All right. Um, so, I mean, looking at difficulty... The Yale House, and then that led to the mines. We went through the host and the depths. Upper Carloth was short, but it was pretty challenging. But I don't know, man. Maybe just the start of the feet, because at the bottom of the mines, that boss was nuts. Um, I think what we're gonna do now that I've reached Memorial, we're about to wrap up, but I think we're gonna go to the bell room. I think we're gonna take that path that weaves all the way to the top and that way we'll, we'll clean that area out. I think that's the best, best plan. So anyway, stay tuned. More Lords of the Fallen will be coming your way.